calling this our redneck camping trip video. And the reason I'm calling it that is you'll see some, in some of the imagery, uh, in some of the videos and some of the stills in this, in this uh, vlog here. But we stayed at uh, Dixieland RV Music Park Campground in Waldo, Florida. And Waldo is on US 301. It's just a, just a little south of Gainesville, Florida. And uh, there's a well-known and popular antique shop and flea market um, right, right across the street from the campground. I mean, we spent a lot of time there. And this was also our first time, very first time, having the A-liner out. So uh, we're going to be showing you some of that stuff. And also this antique mall and flea market that's across the street from Dixie Lane Campground in Waldo. Uh, they have a plaque inside that says they've been highlighted on the PBS show Antiques Roadshow. So, so it's a well-known place. It's kind of interesting. I mean, we liked it. We had fun. Uh, we hope you enjoy this video. And if it's informative and you like it, then please like and subscribe. And there's more content coming. So thank you. Okay, so we're here at Dixieland RV Park in Waldo, Florida. As you can see, they have a little cafe out front. And, and it's been our experience that these small Florida towns, man, people are so cool. They're so friendly and so helpful. And that's the way the whole staff here was. So actually, we drove in through that gate. But this is the office. They have the lines on the ground for social distancing right now. And right next door to the office is the bathhouse. That's where we took our showers. All right, here we are. We're on our first trip with the new A-liner. If the lighting kind of stinks, it's kind of overcast today, so. We're at uh, Dixieland Music Park and RV Campground in Waldo, Florida. So if you're wondering where's Waldo, we found it right here. Believe it or not, a lot of people actually live in this kind of a campground. Um, yeah, they do. This is also a music park. I think last weekend they had like a gospel quartet here. Um, I don't think they've got anything going on tonight. This is, this is Saturday, so we'll see. As you can see, they have a little stage there, a dance floor in front of it. Plenty of room for seating and drinking and having a good time. And we're right over here on the other side. And here we are. Only thing I really don't like about this spot is we don't have a picnic table. You usually get a picnic table. We have no outside table, which kind of stinks, but other than that, this is pretty cool. So I'll show you a first time set up here. Looks like it could rain, so I covered up our fire pit and some of our wood with plastic. There's not buku room inside this thing, so you kind of have to get used to uh, living out of the back of your pickup or SUV. That's why we bought this thing. Oh, well, what do you know? Good morning. I haven't brushed my hair, so. <laughs> so this is inside. It's actually pretty cool. We cooked egg and bacon sandwiches here this morning. This side is almost a queen size bed. And you can put this away into a couch and it's got little end tables on the side, but we kind of leave it open, use it as a catch-all. 
Because you gotta have somewhere to put your stuff where you're camping. That's our coffee center. And there's a the little bubba. Where are you going, buddy? Watch him, I gotta go. There we go. There is no doubt. Bubby, yeah. Bubby, he's cute. I can see Bubba. Look at that lazy dog. <laughs> lazy campground dog. He likes camping. Hey, Bub, you want to go camping? See? Want to go camping? Hey, bud. Don't go to sleep. Are you going to sleep? Are you chilling? <laughs> okay, so unfortunately, <clears throat> like I told you, I didn't take any video at the uh, Antique Mall or the Flea Market. But this is the place I told you about that was highlighted on uh, the PBS show, Antiques Road Show. And we spent the better part of a couple days over there. We bought some stuff for the camper and... You know, it's really, if, if you like flea markets, antique malls, if you like that kind of stuff like we do, this is really, really a cool place. This is what we do during those days and weeks when we can't go camping. We just have a campfire in the backyard. <laughs> so remember, like, subscribe. Thank you. Bye.